Starlets. I'm Sarah from Everyday Starlet. Welcome to my channel. We're bringing a little bit of glamour to everyday life. If you want to join my Starlet squad, be sure you hit that subscribe button. Today I am talking about mascaras. I've talked a lot about mascaras on my channel. Gotta say. I have several very long, very epic mascara reviews that I have done for you in the quest to find the best mascaras. And I actually said after doing so many of those videos that I was going to do a separate video and let you know what my top mascaras are. So that's what this video is. If you've seen any of my other mascara videos, you know that my main concern when it comes to lashes is making sure they stay curled. I have the straightest lashes on the planet. So that's my priority when it comes to picking a mascara. I've tried, I've lost count how many mascaras, but I've tried a lot. I'm not going to try these all on in this video, I'm just going to talk to you about them, but if you want to see me trying these on, I'm actually going to link all of my mascara review videos to this video so you'll get to see, in most cases, first impression and video of me applying these mascaras and, you know, how they lasted throughout the day. So I'm just going to give you a, kind of a quick rundown of my absolute top mascaras for keeping your lashes curled. The first one I'm going to mention is a drugstore option. It's CoverGirl, the Super Sizer Waterproof. I believe I tried the original Super Sizer because I heard about it on Tati's channel. I tried the original, did not keep my lashes curled, tried the waterproof, it did a pretty decent job. I don't like the brush. I don't know. It's very thin, very, like, the bristles are really narrow. I just don't like the brush, but this will give you super sizer lashes. Like, they'll be like, ba-bam. It does get a little clumpy. The waterproof does a decent job of keeping your lashes curled. Not my favorite, but decent, and I wanted to make sure that I threw in some drugstore options for you. This is in my top four, but it's number four. Another one that was actually a a surprise to me when I did my testing. I actually got this, I believe I was gifted this at Gen Beauty. Didn't have any hope for it whatsoever and it actually really impressed me. It's the Pure Big Look with Argan Oil. Doesn't have as much hold as I would like, but it does have a decent amount of hold to it. And I really love the brush. It's a very, very thick wand and the bristles are really narrow, so there's like no chance of you stabbing yourself in the eye with this. I just really like the application and I feel like because it's such a thick wand, you can kind of like push your lashes up to keep them curled. I do feel like my lashes droop a little bit throughout the day. It's not like, it doesn't have the most hold of any of my mascaras, but I will say it's good and the fact that it's got argan oil in it, I feel like when I just am having a day where I just need to throw on some quick mascara and and go and I'm not looking for like pff, bam lashes although I'm kind of always looking for bam lashes but whatever. I feel like on just like an everyday basis I like the idea of putting argan oil on my lashes to kind of make it I don't know a little healthier. So I feel like this is kind of like a go-to for me on a super casual day and it's really easy to remove at the end of the day because I'm so used to like the waterproof formulas and stuff that I'm used to having to like scrub my lashes. So I kind of like using this on just like sort of an everyday casual day running errands basis. Again, not the most hold, but I am still very impressed with how much it has considering, I mean, it's got argan oil in it. For me, in my mind, I thought like mascara with oil in it, my lashes are going to droop, but... I was actually really impressed with this. My favorite from the drugstore is the Maybelline Lash Sensational. Probably no surprise if you've been watching my channel. This is pretty much the drugstore mascara that I use in every video where I'm doing drugstore makeup. I enjoy it. I like the brush. It's like a curved brush. It doesn't have quite the hold of my number one, but if you're looking for a drugstore option, this could be a good option. This is actually the full fan effect. There's another one in a black tube that I don't like as much. The pink tube and the non-waterproof. I noticed that the one, this, the non-waterproof formula, I don't know if it's actually waterproof, I've never officially tested it, but it is very, very long lasting. And I've tried this in the waterproof and it's been almost impossible to remove. And I've had a lot of amazing viewers give me tips on how to remove it and trust me, I've tried all of your suggestions and I still think that the waterproof formula is almost impossible to remove. So for this, you do not need to splurge on a waterproof formula. I actually wouldn't even recommend it. Get the regular one, it's very long lasting. Doesn't have quite the hold of the next one that I'm gonna mention, but this is definitely a great option from the drugstore. Probably my favorite drugstore option. Now for my holy grail, A-list mascara. And if you followed any of my videos, you know this is my go-to mascara. 
This is the Clarins Truly Waterproof. I get so many compliments when I wear this. I actually had a conversation with somebody one time when this girl said to me, she was like, you're wearing false lashes. And I was like, no, I'm not. She's like, oh, so you're just incredibly gifted. Is that it? And I was like, she wasn't that bitchy, but I'm just making her sound bitchy for the story. And I was like, no, it's my mascara. And she's like, what mascara is it? And I had to tell her about this. This is the Clarins Truly Waterproof. I heard about this from In The Froze channel. This is just the perfect mascara. I have not been able to find this available in the United States. It's not even on the Clarins website, on the US website. I have to order this on Amazon and I ordered this in bulk because I love it so much and I'm just like what if I can't find this someday and I just I don't think I can live without this mascara. I've never found anything in all of my testing and all of my searching and believe me I've tried a lot. I've never found anything that is this good. It is like lengthening, volumizing, it holds the curl. It's not the easiest to remove but it's not as bad as other waterproof formulas to remove. I'd say it's kind of like average on par with removing. Because it is waterproof and I know waterproof formulas can dry out your lashes and they're hard to remove, I try not to use this every single day. It's hard not to because I just I can't find anything that lives up to this. This is the absolute holy grail. If you have straight lashes and have trouble with your lashes staying curled, I'm gonna leave a link below this product. You need this. You need this in your life. Like, run, do not walk to your, wait, that, uh, we're talking about online, so you wouldn't run or walk. Look at the link below, you need this. You need this in your life. Now, I don't know why it's not available in the US, why I can't seem to find it in the US. I, it probably has some chemicals in it or something that are banned in this country. I don't know, but at this point, I don't care. <laughs> I really don't. I love it that much. This is just holy grail status. If you are ever wondering what mascara I'm wearing in a video, it's most likely this one. Well, I like the others when I'm filming, this is what I go for. If I need my lashes to look good in any way, shape, or form, this is the one I go to. And I actually, when I'm testing other makeup, I'll notice it, like, in my video reviews. Like, even if I'm testing lipsticks, like, when I'm going through and editing my video and stuff, I'll be like, oh my god, on that day, my lashes look so good, what am I wearing? And I'll go back and remember that it's this. Like, it's just, it's everything. So if you have straight lashes, you need this. This is not sponsored. The links below are affiliate links, but, you know, I'm not getting paid to promote this product. I just love it. If you're suffering from straight lashes, I should have a video that should be up giving you tips for how to keep your lashes curled, so be sure you to check out that video. But if you have a favorite mascara, one that you love or one that you hate, let me know. Leave it in the comment section below. You can see all my mascara reviews, I will make sure those are all linked to this one. So if you want to go through and see all the mascaras that didn't make the top four, I will link those videos to this one. If you found this video helpful, please give it a big thumbs up. A while back, I was suffering from anxiety and depression, and I truly believe that beauty and makeup saved my life, and I believe it can save yours too. So if you want to join my Starlet Squad, be sure you hit that subscribe button. You can follow me on all my social media channels. The links will all be in the description box below, along with links to all these mascaras. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope you join me next time.